hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to link how to add in internal links and external links inside the pdf document using pdf make.js library so in javascript let me show you the demo here so if i click the button you will see the pdf file will be downloaded if i open this file so there is a google anchor link here so if i place my mouse over it you will see it is converted into a hand symbol if i click this i will be redirected to google.com from the pdf document itself so there is a second link which is a internal link inside the pdf document if i click this link i will be redirected to the second page in the pdf document you will see that and if i go to the header section this is another link in, uh, internal link I will be redirected to the header content. So these are the internal and the external links guys. I will show you how to make this inside the PDF document using PDF make .js library. So if you go to the second page, it will redirect you automatically to the second page of the PDF document. If you want to go to a particular section inside PDF document, it will redirect exactly to that section. So let's start building this application guys. I have given all the source code in the video description. So if you want to get all the source code, you can go to the video description link to download all the source code. So let's start building this application. So first of all guys, you need to uh, include all the CDN links of this library, which is PDF make JS library. So if you just search pdf make js it has its own official website so it's a client server side pdf library in pure javascript so now inside our body we will have a simple button we will simply say that uh, generate pdf so when we click this button so we will generate PDF we will execute this method so right here inside the script section inside this function guys what we need to do is that we need to write our document definition of the PDF document and inside this we will have a content property this will be an array and for each page we have a object which have a text property so we will this is we will simply say go to google this will be an external link and the second property will be for the link so inside the link guys you can copy paste the link for which you need to redirect so i will be redirecting to google.com so that's it put a comma this is the first link and in order to save this document guys it is very simple we will say pdf make dot create pdf we will pass the document definition dot download so if i now refresh the application generate pdf so a pdf file will be downloaded if i open this you will see it go to google if i press this i will be redirected to google.com so this is external link guys so let me have uh, uh, a third property which is page break so this will add a new page so in the second page guys we will have an internal link here we will simply say go to page 3 and uh, then we will the property will be simply link to page so here you need to mention the page number to which you need to redirect a user i need to redirect the user to the third page put a comma and then we will again be having a page break property to insert a new page inside the pdf document so again this will be after so on the third page guys we will have again a text 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 property so here this will be go to header and here we will be linking to a particular destination inside the pdf document certain section 
link to destination so here we will mention the id which is header so again we will add a page break after so in the fourth page guys we will mention this uh, destination which is actually the header section and uh, we will attach a id to it of a header this is the id which we are attaching it you will see that so now if i refresh the application so on the first page this will be external link on the second page we have go to page 3 if i i am currently on page 2 you will see that if i hit this button i will be redirected automatically to the page 3 here so this is quite good for navigation purposes and if i go to the click this link here i will be redirected to the fourth page where my header section is available so this is quite easy guys in order to implement easy navigation inside your pdf document these linkings internal links are quite useful so these pdf make library makes it quite easy you can also have external links also so all the source code will be there inside video description guys so please hit the like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video